What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2 and today I would like to talk about defensive mode and how it really does need some changes. Now Rockstar has stated that there will be some changes in the summer update to defensive mode but really the only thing they have mentioned is just adding more health to the player and I'm not sure if this is really going to fix any kind of trolling you know just griefing problems. Uh, the worst issue I ever have with someone killing me is mainly when I'm fishing. You know, I have my back to them. I can't see what's going on. And even though that I am in defensive mode and they don't have that sticky kind of lock on aim, they still have free aim. So if you're fishing, not paying attention to what's going on, they can just ride up, scope up, and shoot you in the back of the head. One shot kill, it's over with. Even if they make it a two shot kill to the, you know, the head, it's still not really going to be a, a, a solution in my opinion. I think that there are a lot of people out there, you know, that, that like the way it is. And then I think there's a lot of people out there that don't like the way it is. Solo players definitely do not like the way it is right now. Um, when you get kind of griefed by a whole team and they just kill you over and over, that gets very, very frustrating and, and makes you really not want to play. It makes you not really enjoy the game. I think there should be two different lobbies. Uh, in, in, in your kind of options for when you select to go into a free roam lobby, you should have the option to go in a lobby where everything goes, you know, you can kill other players and then have an option to go into a lobby where you cannot kill other players. If you pull up and shoot another player in this lobby, it just does not register anything. That way, that way people can have enjoyment in either type of lobby that they want to play. Because um, I know a lot of people out there want to do missions, want to hunt, want to fish, and they don't really want to be bothered by other players trying to kill them or grief them or whatever the case may be. And I know a lot of people will say, well, that's just how the game is. I kind of feel like if you pay for the game, you've paid $65 for a game, you should get to play something that you can enjoy. You shouldn't have to play something that you don't enjoy. Um, so I really feel for the people that want defensive mode, I understand why some people say there shouldn't be, but I do think there should be an option for everyone. However you want to play, there should be an option to be able to play that way. And hopefully Rockstar will continue to fix this. I know they have said many times they don't want solo lobbies because it kind of takes away from the the whole idea of an online mode kind of being like an RPG, other players being in there. But at the same time, I really don't have a problem with solo modes, in my opinion. I also can see some issues uh, kind of with the defensive mode. It's almost, it's not as bad, I guess, as GTA 5, where you can go in passive mode, come out of it, kill someone, and go back in it. I know it was a big problem on GTA 5. I'm guessing that's why it kind of has the 30 second delay here on red dead online that way you know you can't come out and kill someone and go back in immediately but overall i think there needs to be some adjustments not just adding health to players i, I think two separate lobbies uh choices would be the best thing and hopefully they will do something kind of like that i don't really expect it i expect them just to keep adding health to the player that's in defensive mode and i really don't think that's going to be a solution some people just want to play and enjoy themselves some people might want to play and run around and, and fight other posses I think there should be ways for people to play however they want. Of course, guys, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.